This video is brought to you by the Arrest Cam YouTube channel. Be sure to check out the description below and give them the credit they deserve. On March 16, 2023, during a Marine patrol, an officer from the Martin County Sheriff's Office witnessed a woman providing an alcoholic beverage to a minor. This observation likely prompted the officer to take action, as providing alcohol to minors is illegal and poses serious risks to their health and safety. Such actions require immediate intervention to prevent potential harm and uphold the law. How old are you? 25. You're 25. How old are those three girls? I don't know. I just have done well with them. How, do, how old do you think they are? I'm younger than 21. Okay. Then why would you pour them a cocktail? I'm and not pouring them a cocktail. You actually did. You, you poured it into the green solo cup. This and is then, mine. No. You poured it into the green solo okay. cup and then you handed it to the girl in the black bikini. I, I watched the entire time. Why would you do that? I did not do that. Okay. Why would you do that? Who's holding it? Okay, it's in the cup holder when they saw me spin around. So my question to you again is, I watched you pour okay. from the Tito's bottle yeah. into the green Solo cup. And hold on, the cup? hold the green Solo cup that you handed to the girl in the black. Why would... When the officers arrived at the scene, they found two women present and began their investigation with them. However, as they proceeded, another woman arrived and began interfering with the investigation. This unexpected intervention shocked the officers, especially considering the seriousness of the situation. The presence of an additional woman complicates the investigation and raises questions about her connection to the incident or the other individuals involved. Did you do that? I only poured this no, in this No, you didn't. Cup. No, you didn't. Why would you do that? Yes, I did. Why would you do that? I didn't. You did. So go grab your ID and you're under arrest for possession of alcohol under and provide arrest. yes for providing a minor alcohol. I did so, not yeah, even you do did. That. I I'm not blind. I watched you do it. Do you do have it. it on videotape? Go get your license before do you I have put it on you, videotape? Go get your license for the last time. Oh yes. Go away. Go get your ID. No, 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 stop. 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 You're going to give her a ticket? Yes. But you can't arrest her. Yes, I can. I mean, you can, but don't. Do I can. That's I don't care. I don't. I don't I need. Know what I don't need your help. Go I, get your ID. Excuse me, that's you, my daughter. And I, I don't know care how. who she is. She's over the age of eighteen. She can talk to you after I'm done. Wait, well, so we'll get a lawyer, and I want. You're more happened. than welcome to get yourself a lawyer. Right Go get one. What happened? None of your business. She gave an underage help. Who? I just I'm not here to argue with you, and I'm not here to fight with you. you. She provided alcohol to three minors. Initially, when asked about alcohol use, she refused, possibly thinking she could deceive the officers. This reluctance suggests potential deceit or a desire to conceal information, adding complexity to the investigation and prompting further scrutiny by the officers. How do you know she's underage? Do you know she's underage? You don't think those three girls are underage? I could think that. That's okay. Do, would you like me to prove it? What if she's not? Young lady in the black. How old are you? Yes. There we go. She's 15. Oh, wow. All right. I didn't know. I have every intention of it, but I'm not going to argue with everybody here on this sandbar. If she doesn't come over here within the next 30 seconds, I'm putting her in jail. Hurry up! No, we're done. No, no, no. I'm done. Excuse me. Come on, dude. Yes, a rare license. Yes, okay. Sure, I can. Come on. You're, let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Can I just get my ID? Come on. I'm not. Excuse me. Don't resist. Don't resist. For real. For real. For real. Can I just get my ID? You can't give the girl a few minutes to get her ID, dude? No, he's not having it. 
Why are you grab, don't grab the purse. Yeah, I'm grabbing the purse right. because it was in her possession at the time that I no, took it. No, if it was, then why don't you get it? Then why don't you let you give it a purse? Let's go. Step off. Step off. Step off. Step off. Nothing better to do. Nope. Why? Step off. Step off. Come on, let's go. Come on. Yes, don't. You're under arrest now, too. Are Come you on. serious? Yes, I am. Yes. No, you you're done, right too. Now? Let's go. What the f*** are you doing right now, sir? Please stop. I swear to God, please stop. Can you let me show you my ID? Please stop. I'm telling you right now. Right you are under arrest also. Stop. Please stop. I swear to God. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. I promise you I'm not doing the wrong. I don't care. Climb up. I'm right here with you. I promise you I'm not doing anything. When the officers questioned the woman, she became aggressive and started screaming. Another woman also behaved aggressively. It became apparent that the woman was not prepared to admit that she had given a beverage to someone else and had also consumed it herself. Do not stop. Stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Go. My job is here. My I don't care. Go up. Go up. Go up. Go up. Right now. Female officer. Right now. Okay. Right now. Right now. All the way over. Right now. Yep. Right now. You haven't been doing too much. Dude. Right now, dude. What is wrong with you? Go. Step up. Step up. Ladies, I'm with you. Ladies, I stand with you. Go up. Maggie, go up. Maggie, just go. Maggie, go. Come on, man. Maggie, go. Don't touch her. Don't touch her. We got a female officer right now. A female officer. Right now. Are you serious? Just stay up there. Stay up there. Stay up there. Go up. Just stay. Baby girl, just stay. Go up. A female officer right now. Go up. Right now. Don't touch her. Go up. No, female officer. All the way over. All the way over. All the way over. Call your captain, bro. I'm a woman. I'm a woman. All the way back to the boat. All the way to the back of the boat. Sit. No, call him. Call him. Get off. Get off. I'm going to call 911 right now. Go ahead. I am. Call your captain right now. I don't have a captain. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Come on, bro. Call 911. Where are you going, bro? Are you grabbing something? Because I can. Oh, you can? I do. Oh, why? No, why, why, why you doing, just stop. Just stop. Just stop. Why are you grabbing this? We want a female officer. We want a female officer. Go sit back down. We want a female officer. We want a female officer. Call the captain right now, bro. We want a female officer here now. Sit down. A female officer right now. Please be done. Right now. What's that? What's that? What's that? Stay there. I'm busy. You're in arrest for for interference. Okay. You're under arrest for providing alcohol to a minor and resisting minor. arrest. And you're also under arrest for resisting arrest. I'm sorry. And escape. Because so when I put you on the boat, you jumped no, off and tried to hide. I just have a question for you, though. Sir. Sure. What did she do in the first place? She provided alcohol to a minor. But I didn't. You did. So I'm not gonna. This isn't an argument for you. This is on camera. Like, sir, no. Okay. I'm. I'm. So how, how are you gonna prove that? What do you mean? I watched you do I it. I did not even. We're but you did. Kid. But are you did. You're kidding, kidding me. Kid that you're doing this too. Okay, but I didn't do you it. Didn't ask I, didn't, I swear, but I want you. To, when I took her, when I took her off the boat, because you pulled wanted... that from me and then snatched because from me. I, I'm, so I'm, that doesn't work. That's the end of the day. The female's loud and aggressive behavior towards the officer suggested that she was above the law. Both females seemed to think their aggressive actions could save them from charges, but they were mistaken. Such behavior only complicates their situation and potentially worsens their legal consequences. It's a simple you. ticket. 
and you would have been on I your way. But you, you want to acerbate that situation. There is no questioning. I know. Okay? You, you want to acerbate. You want to deny. You don't want to come back to the boat. Guess what? Listen, I don't care what any of those can people I, think. Can I ask you one question? Okay, so here's the deal. You saw, listen. Yes, I can saw I you. Can I speak? Yes. I was going to get my ID. No, you were procrastinating, and I actually sent somebody over to get there. He told you to come in and get your boat. Come bring your ID. I was going you continued, to get my ID. You continued to, to the point where I was able to get my ladder, get off my boat, walk to your boat. You still weren't in your bag. Did, did you not hear me asking her where she put my purse? So, I don't know where I put my purse. I had the purse. She put her purse. I had her purse in my bag. I don't know where she put my purse. Okay. So all it took me was if you could not there five minutes. No, it was my fault. I had her purse. Okay, it doesn't matter. No, it it doesn't matter. When I tell you that you're under arrest and I, and I put handcuffs on you, you don't get to keep pulling away. You don't get to keep fighting me. You don't get to do that. Well, I've never been under arrest, so I don't know. Well, what do you think would happen when handcuffs I, I are put on you? But you does that mean you, does listen, that mean that listen, I get to go play listen, and run around? Let me talk one second. No. Listen, you asked me to get my ID. Yes. Okay? I was getting you my ID, and then you came over to the boat. Yes. You didn't let me provide you my ID. You were given ample opportunity to get it. You decided that you were going to argue with everyone there and try to plead your case. So here's the deal. Okay. Under, so you're listen, under arrest. Listen. Here, this is the end of the problem, all right? As soon as my partner gets over here, I'm going to get life jackets on you, and we're going to the gym. Okay. Okay? Everybody understands that. Okay. Well, what do you think she did wrong? I don't know. I didn't do anything. Okay. And I feel like you're being super unfair by not letting us talk. You can talk all day long. I'm not stopping you from talking. I've already explained it to you. Well, you're the one acting like a moron. I need a set of cuffs. No, please. And then there's some real angry people down there for you. Do you have proof of that, though? Of what? Of her. I, I don't know. Yeah, I, I watched. Asking you a question, I watched. I didn't me. do anything. You did. No, I did not. But you did. Okay. Stand up for me. Yes, sir. Turn your hand. Turn around. Put your hands behind your back. Actually, let's put your vest first. I'm really a traumatized you nurse, like really? Then you know better, don't you? You know better than to come snatching stuff from a cop and then try to pull away from him and then jump off a boat after he's put you in custody and tells you to sit down, don't you? Yes. Yeah, that's what I thought. I have so much to lose right now. Okay, all the way on the ground, not on the seat because we're gonna take a transport, so I need you on the on the ground on the deck. Sorry. On the deck, you? on the deck, sit, sit. yep. All the way down. <laughs> Due to the female's physical behavior, influenced by alcohol, and the officer's confirmation of providing a beverage to a minor, the decision was made to take them into custody. Their actions, compounded by the presence of alcohol and endangerment of a minor, warranted immediate intervention by law enforcement. Stand up. Can I ask you one question? Sure. You have cameras on this, right? No. I have cameras on me. So turn around, turn around. So See, this is again. We, this is again. We don't listen. We don't listen to instructions. We don't do what we're supposed to do. And lo and behold, here we are arrested again. I understand what you're saying, but the videos. I never said anybody under the age of 21 years old a drink. Actually, you did. No, I did not. I'm gonna take this off your head real quick. I'm not getting involved. Right now, I just need you to sit on the floor. That way, we can get back safely. Well, it's okay. Just start over. Just start out. It's fine. It doesn't matter. Is it gonna stay on my head now? Yeah. Okay. Okay. All the way down, please. 
It's on my mom. Okay, all the way down, please. I got old. I look that old. You're the one who told me that you were her mom. No, I'm not her mom. That's my my children are out there. Okay. My six year olds out there. I'll get a car. Alright. They're mad. They're mad. Okay. Well, yeah, they're gonna. Yeah, I wouldn't go over there. Are you surprised? Yeah, I wouldn't go over there. They're not gonna argue with him. I just wanted to know what happened. It was being stupid. <laughs> so you're holding on to your arms? Yeah. Your hat? You got yeah. it? So I mean, I have it by my fingers. All my friends are you, you guys. Put it under the chair? Just slide it under the chair. Yeah. Can we have, like, a somewhat civil conversation? Because I don't understand. Right. Again, you saw that. I just rolled I up. I understand. Yeah, you just Let's rolled up. But let's just. Can I speak with the sheriff? Let's just hold up. Let's make it back to shore, okay. and then we'll let him make okay. that decision. All right. So I just want to understand where I went wrong in this entire thing because I didn't somewhat feed anything to anybody. So. Um, uh, look, I don't even know what happened right now. We're just gonna make sure you guys no, get I back get to shore safely. All right. During a boat search, officials found safety jackets and asked a female to wear one. Initially. She refused and attempted to fight with the officers, shocking everyone with her behavior. This reaction might stem from various reasons such as fear, discomfort, or misunderstanding of the situation. It highlights the importance of effective communication and understanding during such encounters to ensure safety and compliance with regulations. Uh, just trying to throw that out there. So many friends that you guys do. Hi, Do you know Moss? I'm sorry? Do you know Moss? Moss? Yeah. Yep. Wiggins? Sure. I'll have him pray for you. Can I just ask a question? Like, I don't understand if you don't have, like, cameras or anything. I was just making a drink for myself. You're lying. You can tell it any way you want. Okay. I don't, I don't understand how you can say it was a lie if... First of all, you don't have cameras, and I never fed a drink to anybody Our under the age of 21. Three, three, okay. Yeah? <laughs> so then if you have proof, go ahead and show it. You said you didn't that's have for, proof. That's for your defense attorney, not me. All right. Great. You don't remember telling me that that was your daughter? No, I said my daughter was on the boat, my daughter. No, no, no. You said when you came up to me screaming at me and when I told her no, to I get said, her ID that she was your daughter and you wanted to know what was going on. No. You demanded to know what was going on. You don't Sir, remember that. I said I have a six year old daughter. I Excuse need, me, that's you, my daughter. And I, I don't I, care. I, you're not, I don't, I'm her age. Why don't I say it was my daughter? No, that's, I, that's why I had told her she could sit next to her mom. No, I promise you, I'm her. You misunderstood me. I'm no, sorry, I'm but my daughter is six. I said my well, daughter. That's not why you're under arrest. I'm just saying that's why. I understand. Why. I understand. I'm sorry. You're under arrest for your behavior. I'm, I'm sorry, but I'm and, trying to tell you something. what am I under arrest for? Your behavior. Uh, behavior? What was my behavior? Awful. Was it? Because you asked me to get you my ID, so I went no, on I the. I told you were under arrest. Okay. The difference. Correct. You didn't pull your up. Uh, you didn't pull out your handcuffs. You asked me to get you my ID, I was right? I write you a summons, yes. Correct. You asked me to get you my ID. Yes. So what did I do? I went on no, my you boat. You argued with everybody around you. And Can, you let, you, Can you, you let me talk? Can you let me talk? Did I, did I say a lawyer? Three girls, to the three girls, I did not say a lawyer once. Can you put your no, no, video camera at me? That's where they were no, about. please. Despite the officer's advice, both females wore the jackets, but continued to argue persistently. This behavior could be due to various factors such as frustration, defiance, or misunderstanding. Effective communication and de-escalation techniques might be necessary to address the situation calmly. Okay, did I say that? No. no she was telling you to do it. Don't you do just, you just put you words in my mouth, did you, did you not? Yeah, yeah, you did. Yes, you did. Sit down. Sit down. I did not get Sit a lawyer. Down. Okay, Sit never down. once did I say I was going to get a lawyer. I said that they were telling Listen, you to get a lawyer. all I'm asking you asked me to get my ID. Yeah, you did. What did I do? Did Go I on the boat, right? She asked me for her purse. I, I asked her where she put my purse you didn't, you didn't to get, get you my ID. Purse. You did not get your purse. 
purse until I got okay. on the boat and then okay. you went to a bag. Because I did not know where she put my purse. Oh my god. Okay. It took like what, two minutes? Two minutes strong. Alright, just sit tight. Here I we go. I couldn't even get you my ID. You might want to sit on your butt. I don't want you to bounce on your knees and hurt yourself. You're more than welcome to stay like that, but you're responsible for your own age. Can you do it on your own? Yeah, just a little bit. So you got it. Okay, I'm going to take the cuffs off you so I can take this off of you, and then I'm going to put them right back on. What's happening? Corporals? Uh, good for the jacket to come off? Yes, that's what I'm taking. you got to take the cuff off first. Due to the female's physical behavior, influenced by alcohol, and the officer's confirmation of providing a beverage to a minor, the decision was made to take them into custody. Their actions, compounded by the presence of alcohol and endangerment of a minor, warranted immediate intervention by law enforcement. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to go down with these cars. How come they're not getting arrested? That's what I'm facing. I did. <laughs> I don't know what happened again. We're going to come on this one. so sorry. Adopting a child. Listen, listen, listen. I have no idea. I'm gonna fucking traumatize you next. Like, you have no idea. He's so mean. Like, what is he doing I, I don't right know what now? Okay. <laughs> help him. I'll help you. I'll turn the AC up for you guys. He, so, I, I really have no clue what happened. Nothing like that. Um, once you get there, once you. I, I, I don't know his reasoning. I don't know what's happening. So, what's, um, he should be able to. Yeah. Um, he should be, he'll explain it when he gets there because he's the one that's going to do everything. So, so what's happening now? I'm driving you to the sheriff's office. You'll get booked in and he'll do all the paperwork. They will explain it to you. I, I, again, I don't know. Again, I don't know what happened. I have no clue what happened. Okay? I know, but I would traumatize you, nurse, and you have no idea how much I have to lose. Like, please. I'm adopting a child. Like, you have no idea. I did not do anything wrong. Like, I swear to God. <laughs> you have no idea. I would tell you if I did something. I hate all my God. I'm sorry. I can't take care of people every day of my life. And like, to be treated like that, it just feels like shit. I'm sorry. Maggie, age 25, found herself confronted with charges of providing alcohol to a minor, compounded by an accusation of obstruction without violence. Meanwhile, Jessica, age 36, was solely charged with obstruction without violence. These charges delineate their roles in the incident, with Maggie shouldering the added responsibility for providing alcohol to a minor. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the like button, share your thoughts in the comments section, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. To stay updated on our future videos, click the notification bell icon after subscribing. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.